submit the job file to the print server's hold queue. At the print server, double-click the job to open its properties. On the Quick Access tab, enter the paper size and paper source where you loaded the paper and the number of copies. On the Media tab, for duplex, select Top Top. If printing on two sides of the paper, for simplex, printing, leave the setting off. On the Finishing tab, under Fold, set Fold. Style to Booklet Fold. Note, this step assumes that your job is already imposed correctly. If you need to impose it, first select Booklet to set the imposition, and then continue with these steps. You can also close the job properties and right-click on the job to select Impose to use this tool. Fiery Impose will give you more control over edits, creep, gutter, and other settings. Fiery Impose is optional. On the EXI 180 print server, on the Finishing tab under Stapler, set Stapler mode to center. On the Finishing tab under Trim, select the box for head and foot trim. Use the up and down arrows to set the finish. Size of pages. This is the distance from the top of the page to the bottom. This distance will be centered on the page. For spine printing, select Normal. Select the box for Engage 4, Face Trim. Use the up and down arrows to set the face. Trim. You can set either the finish size, which is the distance from the spine to the right side of the page for a left bound booklet, or the amount of the face to be trimmed. If your file has been pre-imposed, the settings are now complete and you can release the job to print. However, if the file is not pre-imposed, access the Layout tab and select Booklet to set the imposition you want for the job. If you are not inserting pre-printed covers, proof the job, check the output, and then release the job to print. For optionally inserting covers when the job is pre-imposed. If you have an inserter configured with your press, you can optionally insert pre-printed cover sheets for the booklets. The size of the cover sheet should be the same as the body sheets, and the booklet maker will wrap the pre-printed cover sheet around the body pages to form a front and a back cover. Load the pre-printed cover stock into the inserter, tray T1. Program the stock at the control panel. Select the Media tab and scroll down to select Define Cover. Click the checkbox for Front Cover and select Insert from the drop-down menu. For Paper Source, select T1. 4. Set any other unique paper properties for the cover stock, if they are different. From the body stock. For example, the GSM weight may be heavier. Click OK on the Cover Media window. Click Print on the Media tab to release the job. For optionally inserting covers when the job is not pre-imposed. If you have an inserter configured with your press, you can optionally insert pre-printed cover sheets for the booklets. The size of the cover sheet should be the same as the body sheets and the booklet maker. We'll wrap the pre-printed cover sheet around the body pages to form a front and a back cover. Load the pre-printed cover stock into the inserter, tray T1. Program the stock at the control panel. Select the Layout tab. Select the Booklet Radio button. Scroll down to the cover area. For Content Input, select Pre-Printed. Click Define Cover. For Cover Source, select T1. For Media Weight. Select the GSM for the cover stock and set any other unique cover stock. Properties. Click OK. Click Print on the Layout tab to release the job.